don't think you enjoy breathing, but it's time to go to bed. Now close your book. I'm going to have a piece of a bite. Good girl. I love you, sweetheart. Love you too. Sweet, sleep well. If you need me, you know where I am. Dave, you know, I'm really, really upset about you leaving tomorrow. Oh, uh, you know I have to go, honey. It's I only going to be two nights. But I mean, I just, it's like the biggest career move of my life. There's this big brunch. I mean, I just wish you were there with me. You'll do fine, honey. You've been there for six years. They deserve to give you a raise. That's what I'm so nervous about. I don't want to ask about the promotion. I'm afraid it's going to be like... With time to be. Yeah. I'm only going to be in Manhattan for two nights, and I'll be back on Friday. What time do you think? Uh, about noon. What time is your brunch? It's at 12.30, but I think I'm going to leave at like 11.30, because I want to get there early. I want to propose my new um, proposal to my boss. <laughs> Two o'clock. I hope no later than three o'clock because I don't want to leave um, Taylor with the babysitter. Um, who are you getting for dinner? I'm hoping Karen. I tried to call oh, her. Oh, Karen's good. She She's so her. sweet. Yeah. She got her to bed immediately. Right. Good but night. she wasn't. Yeah, she wasn't home today, so I'm hoping for tomorrow she'll be home tomorrow so I can call her. Oh, let me shut off the light. I forgot to. Good night, dear. Good night, sweetheart. Yes, she is. Oh. Honey. Honey, it's time to wake up. You have your big business proposal today. Honey. Yeah. All right, I'm going to go wake up Taylor. All right, All right good to yeah. get? It's so bright. Yeah. Are you leaving now? You yeah, I have to rush out, so I'm just going to wake her up and leave. You're all ready to go? Yeah. business meeting, so see you later. Yeah. Wake up now. Taylor, Taylor honey, you gotta get out of bed. Be good for your mother. Taylor, you gotta get out of bed, okay? See you later, honey. Oh, you leave me? Well, let, let us see you out the door. Come on. I'll bring the kitty. Taylor, you don't have your jacket. Uh, look, yeah, I left it in the car. Okay. Hello, Karen. How are you today? Well, hi, Mrs. Carter. You look very nice. Thank you 
so much. Okay, well, thank you so much for coming on such short notice. I'm running a little late, but I should be out of your way in just a minute. You know all the emergency information. It's all on the, and my, my husband and myself and are both on the um, refrigerator, but I wouldn't, if you really can't get in touch with me, call my husband, but he's in Manhattan, so it might be a little difficult for him to come home anyway. Um, yeah, but um, Taylor ate breakfast, but if she wants lunch, that's fine. And there's a lot of easy stuff to make in our freezer. There's pizza bagels, you know, all that easy stuff. And you're welcome to have whatever you want. Um, is there anything else you need to know? I'll, I'm hoping to be home at 3 o'clock. If I'm going to be any later, I'll give you a call. Do you need to be anywhere? No, I'm free for the day. That sounds good. Okay. Well, Taylor, I want you to be a good girl, okay? Do not give Karen a hard time. Alright, guys. Mm -hmm. I love you so much, girl. I think I got some lipstick on your nose. <laughs> Thank you so much for coming. Bye. Bye.